Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Yavin from YourEasyFilm.com and today we're gonna talk about the vertigo effect, which looks like this. Okay, so what is the vertigo effect? The vertigo effect is like a background distortion and I'm pretty sure you've seen that in some famous Hollywood movies. And you can create this effect if you move backwards with your camera but zooming in. And also the opposite, if you move forward with your camera, you will zoom out. Okay, it works the best if you have a big dolly moving forward and then changing the focal lengths. But you can also create this effect in post-production. It doesn't look perfect, but you can still see a great result. Okay, it will work the best if you shoot it on the gimbal because your footage will not be shaky and also in 4K resolution because you can zoom in without losing any quality. And I would highly recommend using a drone for this because the movement in the drone is way smoother when, than when you have a gimbal and walking on the ground. Okay, there are two different ways to create it. We're gonna drag and drop our clip into the timeline. So if I fly backwards with my drone, I'll use the scale in effect. And when I fly forward with the drone, you should zoom out a little bit. So what we're gonna do is we select our clip, go onto effect control panels, and then hit the toggle animation of scale. So here we are in the beginning of the effect. So we create a keyframe and we let it on 100%. Then we're gonna go to the end of the clip and add another keyframe and scale it up maybe to 180 or 200, whatever we want. And boom, that's it. So now you can play with the scaling. It depends on how fast you're gonna fly backwards. Yeah, you need to try out some different specs because sometimes it looks better when it scales very fast and sometimes it looks better it looks better when it scales very slow. Okay, so now we're gonna do the opposite. Here we're gonna have a clip where I'm flying forward. And we're gonna do the same steps again. Hit the stopwatch animation of scale. Let, let the beginning at 100%. And then we're gonna zoom out and in the end of the clip, it should be at 50 for example, and boom. Okay guys, that was the tutorial on how to create the Vertigo effect in Premiere Pro. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave me a like and a comment. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video. Peace out.